Jake Crow in Fergus Falls. We're standing uh, next to a parking lot, just to the south of our downtown. Uh, give an example of, I think, what uh, demonstrates a uh, overemphasis on surface parking in our city. Uh, Fergus Falls is unique in that it maintains a, a very uh, uniform main street. There's no no missing teeth in it. All of our buildings stand shoulder to shoulder for the three blocks that our main street runs through our downtown area. However, uh, this has uh, been done at the expense of the surrounding blocks. Uh, we have many, many service parking lots such as this one uh, lining both sides uh, streets surrounding our main street. I chose this lot in particular because it's an example of uh, one of the lots I feel is unnecessary. Uh, this lot typically serves the county courthouse which is uh, located kitty corner to, to this location and uh, for the last couple of weeks it has been closed as construction vehicles have staged here for various uh, jobs that they're doing in the area. I'm not quite sure exactly what they're fixing up but uh, this lot has, has been closed for some time. Uh, typically this lot holds somewhere around, uh, it has anyway, 20, about 24, 25 spaces and uh, it's, it's never completely full during the day. Right now I'm filming this, it's about 2.30 in the afternoon on a Wednesday, so this would be pretty representative of peak parking. Uh, we can see that the surrounding lots full to accommodate this, this lack of parking, though these lots are nowhere near at capacity. And we also see that uh, parking has spilled out onto the streets a little bit more than, than typically happens, although if you, if you look over this way, uh, this half of the this half of the lot here, the parking is still quite sparse. So uh, it's interesting to to note this kind of a natural experiment uh, that uh, even with the, uh, with the you know loss of spots caused by the closure of this parking lot, uh, we're nowhere near a, a parking crisis in this area. Uh, this should hopefully be you know a lesson to take away from this. Uh, when considering future development plans in and around downtown Fergus Falls.